the sensory practice we're going to do uh, gratitude bites. This is something that I uh, suggest to my clients on a regular basis and that I do in sessions with them as well because my passion is getting people into their body, reminding us that we have a body, that we are a body. This is a really great way to wrap up any session or even just to do a midnight shower, um, just as a reminder that we have so much in our bodies uh, to be thankful for. So you can be in a seated position, you can be lying down, you can be doing dishes, it doesn't really matter what you're doing with your body, just having the intention that we're beginning a new day off with gratitude. So take a deep breath in through your nose and out through your mouth, just allowing that breath to nourish your whole body from the tips of your fingers to the tips of your toes. Taking a deep breath in from your chest, from your taking a deep breath in from your belly, rolling from your chest and exhaling from your chest to your arms and legs. With every inhale, lengthening, and every exhale, a deep round of gratitude, being grounded with whatever part of your body is touching the ground. On your first inhale, we'll be sending our intention to the ground. Just as you breathe in, feel the breath all the way from your toes through to your chest and all the way back down through to your toes. Feel attention being brought to your face and body, to your pinky toes, to your middle finger, to your fourth finger. Allow your attention to go in through each toe and have a spark of gratitude for each toe. For if you had one less would be awesome. May each of your 10 toes bring such a unique energy to your body that allows you to come from your heart. Feel yourself have gratitude for the inner workings of your toes, for the outside of your toes, for what they do and for how they feel. Take a deep breath in through your nose. allow your attention to focus on your feet and hands. As you breathe in, allowing that attention to your feet and hands to be filled with gratitude for every single bone in your feet and your fingers, our little bones and tendons and ligaments in your feet, feeling gratitude for each one has such a special and unique purpose. Allowing yourself to feel gratitude for your heels, for your arches, for every part of your feet to come to all come together. It is allowed for you to experience the gratitude of your heart. On your next inhale, moving that gratitude energy upward and inwards by connecting the between your feet and the rest of your body, allowing yourself to feel gratitude for your ankle bones, all different parts of you, the inner bones, the outer bones, the Achilles, all different parts of your ankles, allowing that gratitude to fill the space of your ankle. Taking a deep breath in through your nose, allow that gratitude energy to move up through your Allowing that gratitude energy to expand greater into your calf, from the front of your shins to the back of your calf, from your shin bone to your legs, maybe the hair on your legs. Allowing yourself to feel gratitude for each and every part of your lower body. That it allows you to walk, to run. a deep breath in, moving that gratitude energy towards your knees, 
nodding someone to you, the connecting point for your legs, taking a deep breath in and allowing the gratitude to surround your ACL, your MCL, all of the different ligaments and tendons that take up the cartilage of your knee. Taking a deep breath in, allowing that gratitude energy to extend from your knees to your knees. Strong and beautiful, your thighs are so amazing. Allow your gratitude energy to take up space in your thighs, to feel gratitude for cellulite, to feel gratitude for the bones, to feel gratitude for the hole, to feel gratitude for every single part of your body. Moving that gratitude energy towards your butt, allowing that gratitude energy to fill every single bone in your buttocks, allowing yourself to feel gratitude for all of the places where your butt hangs out, in classrooms, on planes, in the arms of a lover, on couches and coffee shops, that your buttocks have seen so much and are just so strong. Allowing that gratitude energy to move up through your lower back, feeling your lower back expand with gratitude as any tension dissolves away. Feeling gratitude move up through your back through your spine to your mid-back and all the way up to your upper back. Allowing this gratitude to be felt in your spine as your back has held you with dignity, with respect, and with self-compassion through many days, many dark days, many light days. Feeling gratitude for how your back has held you, how it has kept you upright, it has kept you strong, and beautiful. Moving that gratitude energy toward your hips, your hip bones, how they look, your pelvis, feeling gratitude for everything that your pelvis encompasses, all of the organs that are inside your pelvis, whether it's your uterus or your bladder, everything that is within your pelvis is being connected. Feeling that gratitude move up to all of your inner organs, your kidneys, your lungs, your pancreas, your small intestine, your large intestine, your stomach, all of these organs doing such good work and allowing your body to feel gratitude for the digestive system, how it has served you, how it has nourished you, how it has brought you here. Allow that gratitude energy to encompass your whole inner world. On your next inhale, feel that gratitude energy move up towards your chest, your lungs. If you identify as a woman, your breasts, um, allowing that gratitude energy to fill the space that it takes up, allowing the gratitude energy to expand with your lungs, to feel gratitude energy manifest in your femininity. Moving this gratitude energy up with your next inhale, allowing this gratitude energy to take up space in your shoulders, from your collarbone to your shoulders, allowing this gratitude energy to be felt by the strength of your shoulders. It has carried many backpacks, many babies, and it will carry many more. So much stress is held in our shoulders and just feeling gratitude for the burdens that your shoulders have carried. Allowing this gratitude energy to move through your arms, through your upper arms, to your lower arms. Allowing this gratitude energy to flow through your elbows, experiencing a deep love for all of the things that your arms have done, all of the things that your arms have held all of the things that your arms have brought you to. Picture yourself in a hug with a friend, with a partner, holding things that bring you value. Your arms have allowed you to do so. Feeling that gratitude energy move through your hands, from your thumb to your 
index finger to your middle finger to your ring finger to your pinky finger allowing this gratitude energy to move through you with the vigor moving this gratitude energy on your next inhale back through your arms up into your neck feeling your vocal cords your esophagus Allowing your body to feel gratitude for its intelligence, to hold so much, your trachea, your larynx, in such a small area. Allow yourself to feel gratitude for your neck, what it has done to hold you, to keep your mind and body connected. Moving this gratitude energy up through to your head. Allowing this gratitude energy to move across your face, from your eyebrows, keeping your eyes safe to your eyelids, your eyeballs, your nose for smelling, your lips for speaking, for kissing. Allowing yourself to feel this gratitude radiate over your cheeks towards your ears. Allowing this gratitude to speak so deeply to your senses. Feel what this gratitude is like in your body. Moving this gratitude energy up towards your hair, a constant reminder of new life and new growth. Moving this gratitude energy with your next inhale in towards your brain, to your prefrontal cortex where you make logical decisions, in towards your Broca's area that allows you to process language, towards your hippocampus where memory is stored, in towards your amygdala, the alarm center of your brain that has kept you safe through so much. Allowing this gratitude to move towards the temporal region of your brain that helps you process time and space. And allowing this gratitude energy to sink towards the back of your brain, the reptilian brain, where we have our fight or flight instinct. Allowing yourself to feel a deep gratitude for this area of your brain that has kept you safe. On your next inhale, allowing yourself to be bathed in this light of gratitude. Feeling it pulse through your whole body, from the tips of your fingers to the tips of your toes, all the way back up to the top of your head. On your next inhale, allow yourself to feel deeply this gratitude energy as you take a deep breath in you can slowly open your eyes if they were closed or you can get back to doing your dishes or where, wherever you were but allow yourself to feel gratitude for spending this time this investment into your body into feeling what it's like to be in your body 